Good morning guys and girls. Um, today we're doing something a little bit different. Um, there was quite a good response from our, from the little estuary lures and things like that. So we've kind of branching out a little bit today. Um, we're going to be doing very similar to how golfers have a what's in the bag type of thing where you look at what clubs they're using. We're going to be diving in a little bit and looking at the kind of tackle that I've been using and the stuff that I'm enjoying at the moment. Very different from everything else. Um, we are doing one of my carp setups. Now, this is one of my favorite sticks. It is very unconventional. Um, not meaning that it's a specimen stick, but it is. You are looking at guys normally fish with about a 12 foot, 12 to 13 foot. But this is a stick that's really more suited for your female anglers, your juniors, and if you're fishing closer in. So the 12 foots are nice because you can get a bit more distance. The 10 foot, which is what this is, is nice for your 180 and closer. Um, 100, you're pushing it. 80 meters, very, very comfortable. And then obviously you can fiddle around from there. This is the MCAST, the 10 foot version. It's a 10 foot, three pound. Um, comes in a two piece, like most carp rods. It is known officially as the MCAST 0300. They are beautiful little sticks, light. Um, nice thin carbon blanks, they throw beautifully, they sit nicely on the rod rack, nice thing to look at, which is a bit of a consideration when you're going to be there for a while. Um, but it's really my smuggle stick, it's the one I put in the car when we're going camping and the missus doesn't know that I'm going to be fishing. Onto that, um, I've paired our new entry level little bait runner. Um, this is the Regal 3000. It is a very sexy looking reel, graphite body. Uh, aluminium spool they look it's not a 3000 rand reel is entry level but for everything and anything and for the smaller stuff smaller side of life handles everything that I've managed to throw at it so far bait runner obviously two drag functions sitting on the rest you're gonna be running on bottom drag as soon as you pick up it clicks into top drag then you can be fighting the fish that's the 3000 size there is a four um, I've chosen the three just because it's a nice light little setup. It fits easily on the 10 foot. Onto that small little spool, you will be highly surprised, but I have paired that with our Kingfisher Giant abrasion. That is the six pound, 2.7 kg in the uh, clear. And that full 600 meter spool fits on there. So you can really, it's not ideal, but you can fish that at distance if you really wanted to. Um, but like we said, if you do pick up anything, even a barbell on there, you're going to handle them with ease. Um, and then onto that, I normally put a leader um, from one of my other setups, normally about 12, 15 pound leader onto there just to be able to throw. And if you've seen the videos recently um, on our Facebook and uh, on the Instagram, Gilbert has been throwing this very rod. Um, you'll see a video of him there. He's probably maxing out at about three ounces. Um, but yeah, that is my little carp setup and it's a fabulous little setup, very, very, very comfortable in the pocket. Um, and yeah, like I said, it's nice and small, being 10 foot, it's only two little five foot pieces that you have to, you have to put somewhere, so it fits in the back of most cars. Um, and yeah, just a lovely little rod, especially if you're going camping, you're not sure, you just want to take one rod just to put out, nice and small little stick to do that, fits in the bank stick nicely. So yeah, that's my, my little ultralight car product if you want to call it that. Cheers.